That's why I'm still marching. Yeah. Yes, I got books out. Yes, I got a TV show, but I'm a mountain climber. I'm not going to stop till I get to the top of the mountain. You can call me names on right wing television. I'm a mountain climber. I expect stumbles to come my way. I'm a mountain climber. You can disgrace me. You can discredit me. But I'm going to keep on climbing. I'm going to climb until Tyrese Nichols get justice. I'm going to climb until Eric Gardner gets justice. I'm going to climb until we change the laws. We're mountain climbers. We're not day traders. We're mountain climbers. And if God be for us, it's more than the whole world against us. What would Sterling Allen Brown want to say to Al Sharpton and the protesters in Ferguson today? I what don't would know. You say, what would you say to them, to Al Sharpton? And well, I'm sure it couldn't be repeated on television, but uh, <laughs> I would say nothing, actually. Why is that? I am sure that Jesse Jackson makes 10 times as much money a year as I do. And I don't think I should take on the project of convincing somebody to reduce his income by 90%. <laughs> All right. Have you ever debated Jesse Jackson? No, I haven't. Is that because, would you like to, or would he not want to do that? I have no idea. I have no idea. Uh, I've You'd seen be willing to, I assume. Oh, I, it, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Uh, you think that's too much showbiz? It is. Uh, you know, there's a, there's a, there are people who go out and do this, and I, I'm doing less and less of it. And I tell them the story of an, of an African uh, boxing champion who fought an Irishman in St. Patrick's Day, Day in Dublin. And he lost his title on what the sports writers called a questionable decision. <laughs> 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 yes. And so you have to know what forum you're talking about. Right. I, was, I, was, I saw Shelby Steele on with him, and I said, you know, if Jesse Jackson and Shelby Steele each had to present a two-hour lecture to an audience with an average IQ of 120, Shelby would wipe him out. But if they had five seconds each on Donahue, it would be Jesse Jackson all the way. Right. So everything depends upon the forum. Uh, is Jesse Jackson good for African Americans or no, not? He's, he's not. good for himself. Good for himself. And that's true of most ethnic leaders in most groups in most countries in most periods of history. That what will make what will serve his interest is to keep people paranoid, dependent upon him, dependent upon government. What will serve their interest is typically just the opposite. 